just find? We just found out that your timing belt is way overdue. Which was obvious because, uh, is this on the cover here? Yeah. It says that it was uh, done back in uh, September 03 with 120,000 kilometers on it. It is now 2018 and I have 327,000 kilometers on it. So I knew I had to do it and uh, it clearly shows it's cracked and I can actually take this and slip it off right now if I want it. Which means it's loose. It's stretched. It's stretched. Okay. So if it were to go, it's a non-interference engine, right? That's your engine. I have yeah. no idea. It is. So <clears throat> it'd be okay, I guess. But you still don't want it to happen. You know my domestics. I, I don't know these ones. What else do you notice on them? Everything else seems good. Your belt is. Okay, cool.
We made it to the Pistons. Finally. Finally. Can I pause the music for a second? Yeah. How do we do it? Okay. All right, let's, what's up? Okay, so these are your oil journals. Yep. This is your coolant. Okay. This is why you have no oil in your coolant, because these are your coolant jackets. Yeah. This is where it was leaking from. Right. If we were to look, we'd probably find out where it was bypassing, but it was probably just seeping all the way across. I think these are your returns. That's an oil supply. And possibly this one as well. So these are my lifters? Those are your valves. Valves. These are spark plugs. Thank you. It actually looks really clean. Really? Yeah, this is what happens when you actually run a decent fuel. What kind of, like, like, like shell? Uh huh. How come these ones are cleaner than these ones? This one might be just burning a little bit. Different. You might be starting to get antifreeze coming into the cylinders. But how come, like, this row is clean and this one is dark? Oh, this is your intake? Yeah. Or no, these are your exhaust. This when is the intake. So these ones are always going to be hot. These ones are always going to be cold. So the air is being sucked in through these two. Yeah. And it's the hot exhaust is being blown out through these ones. So these ones are always getting cooked. Okay. Always. How do you know it's in really good shape? Because there's no real discoloration or anything like that. Like it's cleaned off, but it's not too, too bad. Like it's not super polished or anything. So it doesn't look like there's any leaks. It might look like they're, it could have been starting to, but nothing too extravagant. It's really good to see, especially for a high mileage engine. Yeah. My little head. Is this a head? Yep. So, yeah. Well, no, I mean, like, you know. These are an oil drain, oil drain. This one is a supply. No? Well, maybe, but I think these are your supplies, and these are your drain backs. And what about the condition of these? Not bad. Fairly clean, actually. Really? Yeah. Are these, is this carbon or what? Yeah, it's just carbon buildup. I'm not pointing towards a head gasket. What? For... No, it's actually really good. How can you tell? Because it, it's... Oh, Sam, you have no idea how good of a sign that is. No ridge? No ridge. Oh, it's very good. Why? That means that we don't need a ridge reamer for one thing, and that means the actual wear and tear on this is a lot lower than actually we thought. Wow, that's amazing. It means you take care of it. That's what happens when you take care of it. Like you realize you get away with probably just new, new rings. That's it. What's a ring? Just new rings on your pistons. Oh. But we're replacing the pistons? Yeah. It comes with the kit. Wow. Oh, so you have no idea how nice that is to see. Dude, this thing still has a honing in it. You see the crisscross? So the lines in the cylinder? Yeah. That's good. There's nothing. Like, they're so clean. Mm -hmm. And the honing's still in there. I've never seen an engine with this high kilometers with a honing still. Yeah. In which case, girl, that's good. That's really good. Like this, you know how I said it just needs a light honing? But it depends on the degree of damage. This is like two minutes per cylinder. Like I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this going, this is, this is the kind of condition you see at an engine that has 110,000. That's the condition you see, not 300,000. <laughs> <gasps> um, 